Hello everyone, meet again with my channel car, interior and exterior, in this video we will discuss about cars 2023 Mitsubishi Pajaro Sport. Mitsubishi is launching the new Pajaro Sport you see here, based on the latest Triton L200 pickup introduced late last year. The new Pajaro Sport, known as the Challenger in certain markets, replaces a model that's been on the market for seven years now. The midsize sport utility vehicle is being introduced first in Thailand, but will be sold in about 90 countries around the world. Those will include Australia, Russia, and markets in the Middle East, Africa, Latin America, and Southeast Asia, regions in which Mitsubishi has sold some 400,000 units of the previous Pajaro Sport. Behind the imposing new dynamic shield front end sits a 2.4-liter turbo diesel driving all four wheels through a new 8-speed automatic transmission. The combination is said to be a good 17% more economical than the previous models. Full specs have yet to be revealed, but it's expected to produce around 180 horsepower and 317 pound-feet of torque. The new Pajaro Sport also packs all the latest safety technologies, including automatic braking, blind spot monitor, and ultrasonic misacceleration systems. Rock crawlers will also appreciate the off-road mode, hill descent control, and increased weighting depth, all of which add up to make the Pajaro Sport a very different kind of high-riding Mitsubishi than the new Outlander recently introduced on our side of the Pacific. Here in North America, truck-based SUVs are steadily losing ground to car-based crossovers. But overseas, particularly in the Asia-Pacific region and Australia, they're not only surviving, but thriving. In addition to this Pajaro Sport, Ford recently introduced its new Ranger-based Everest, and Toyota the new Fortuner based on the Helix.